got another exciting Creature Corner episode for you today, guys. Now, if your dogs are anything like mine, they hate being cleaned. But today, we're going to be meeting Christy, who runs Fur Fitness. It's a brilliant business that makes bath time fun time for both pet and owner. But don't take my word for it. Let's go see what she's all about. Christy, thank you so much for coming to the program. Really appreciate it. No problem, my pleasure. So who's this little one here? This is Bailey. So she comes in pretty much every three to four weeks, don't you, Bailey? We do um, full grooming or just yeah, brushing, whatever the dog needs, really. We encourage people to stay and actually they can do it themselves. We show them how to use all the equipment to teach people how to maintain them at home. Because um, it, it, grooming to a dog is, can be quite stressful. Yeah. I was a vet nurse for 14 years and I don't know anything else other than dogs and cats yeah. and animals. You can sit down and have a coffee while yeah. we wash the dog. So lots, we have lots of fun. We do fur colouring. Yeah, give them pink tails and things like that. It's not permanent. It washes out, so it's something fun. We do doggy daycare as well. Some dogs that don't like to be home for long periods on their own yeah. can come in here and play. Bring Bailey a wash, which she's pretty happy about. The water's really warm, so... I think she's quite happy about it. She's not that upset. Some dogs love it. Other dogs don't like it so much. Yeah. But um, it's just getting them used to it, really. Yeah. She's getting a fresh. Yes. <laughs> That's incredible. It's, it smells delicious and it's um, quite calming, soothing, brightening. It's safe to use around their eyes. So much easier to use a bath like this than yeah. to mess up your laundry at home that's for sure. In the bath what we do is we fill up the chamber with about 10 litres of water so the shampoo's coming out the nozzle with the water and it just recycles so it's going to save a lot of water. How often should you actually wash your dog? Pretty much um, depending it depends on a whole range of things yeah. the dog's coat type their skin. As long as you're using um, doggy shampoo you probably uh, probably more than once a week is yeah. too much because they've got the natural oils in their coat. But all our shampoos here are very gentle. You need to use a, a dog shampoo soap free like because they have two different yeah. pH levels in people. You've been bringing Bailey here for quite a while. Oh yes, quite a few months now. Yeah. yeah, really. And it's a lovely place to bring her. Yeah. They do the best job. They do, don't yeah, they? Yeah, absolutely. Christy, tell me about these wonderful tidbits here. Aren't they fantastic? Well, they're all um, made of human grade product. Like right. ingredients, so they're very. Um, there's no preservatives, artificial mm -hmm. colours or flavours. Made not as a complete diet for a dog, but right. just as a treat. There is a lot of companies now that do dog dog treats, but a lot of them have a lot of um, fat in them. Mm -hmm. So these are like really low fat. Yeah. So here we make them fresh most days. So okay. We only make what we're really going.